Well, across the street from the Buffalo Zoo, a new studio that says it specializes in connecting people through art, and that's where we find Jeff Russo tonight for this week's Believe in Buffalo. Jeff, looks like a lot of fun. Yeah, we are on the road for this week's Believe in Buffalo. All right, parents, we're only a couple days into summer break, right? Are you already looking for screen-free options for your little ones to tap into their creativity? Well, this may be the answer. Tonight, we are at Making Waves Art Studio. The owners here have years of experience as an art teacher, and she's looking to pass on that knowledge to the young and young at heart. I find that making art really centers kids and adults and makes them present and in the moment. All right, we're going to show you how you can tap into all the fun. It's coming up on this week's Believe in Buffalo. We're back now with our Believe in Buffalo series, focusing on the good news that we all want to hear about. Every week we hit the road visiting different communities, shining light on the people, places and projects that give us hometown pride. Tonight, we're back in the Queen City and my colleague Jeff Russo is live at a unique new art studio right across from the Buffalo Zoo. Jeff. Good evening, Leah. Here's a question for you. When's the last time you sat down with some art supplies and loved ones just to create? No screens, just art. Kind of like these Jeff sunglasses that I just whipped up here. Well, the owner here at the new Making Waves Art Studio on Parkside Avenue believes that creativity equals calm, confidence, and connection for both the young and young at heart. The process is more important than the finished product, but the finished product is gonna be cool too. There's a cool new space right across the street from the Buffalo Zoo. I wanna see a lot of smiling faces. Offering kids, adults, and families a creative outlet, a sense of calm, and a break from the day-to-day -day grind. Once people are participating, I want them to just feel at home and in the moment. Katie Huger is the designer and owner of the new Making Waves Art Studio on Parkside Avenue. Making art really centers kids and adults and makes them present and in the moment. In that vein, Making Waves Art Studio offers a variety of classes and workshops and also drop-in art making sessions where families can simply stop in, get a break from the screens and let the creativity flow. I just find when kids are making art, they're generally really happy. Making Waves is a passion project for Huger, who has evolved from an art teacher to a stay-at-home mom to an entrepreneur. I taught for a total of 10 years and then was gonna stay home for a year when I had my first baby. And then I had my second baby, and then I had a third baby, all in 36 months. So I decided with my husband it was time for a transition. Mm -hmm. Then the pandemic hit, so I was home for another couple years. And then during the pandemic, it, I was inspired to start doing something that, with my passion and my expertise and background again. That inspiration led to Huger to design art boxes for families during the pandemic that she sold online and at local markets and festivals. She now ships them across the country through a subscription service. And that focus on enrichment activities carries over to making waves. The goal is to just use art to inspire kids in their lives. Of course, the big kid in me wanted to try. So Katie kindly broke out some paint and we got to work. So what are we doing? We are doing some process art. We're gonna paint with lemons and limes. There are no rules. No and rules. And that is what a lot of the kids say. They're like, yes, there's no rules. And then you just stamp it on, push it down, pick it up, see what happens. Cool. And then if you stamp more without adding more paint to it, you'll start to see the Oh, I see. So I need, to add, I need to add another color. So we stamped. This is very soothing. It's very soothing. We created. So do you allow people to make as big of a mess as I'm making? Yes. Right? Okay. And bigger. We make lots of messes in here. It's a lot of fun. And in just 10 minutes, masterpieces. Cool. So much fun. Isn't that artwork a piece? I don't know, like a masterpiece, I think. You see my friends here finishing up their projects here at the art studio tonight. They're working on the sunglasses, kind of like I made. This place does everything, workshops, family fun, 
You can even host a birthday party here at Making Waves Art Studio. We have full information on the website right now at wkbw.com, and I think my friends and I are gonna be trendsetters with these sunglasses here. I may wear them all summer. So check out the Believe in Buffalo portion of our website. Also, if you have a project or a story that you would like to see that you think that we should check out, let us know. There's a submission form on our website, wkbw.com, also under the Believe in Buffalo tab. So Leah, we got some work to do. We've got to do some painting over here with the citrus, may make another pair of sunglasses, having a lot of fun here on Parkside Avenue tonight. So I got to finish this up. So we're gonna to have to send it back to you in the studio for Believe in Buffalo. I'm Jeff Russo, we'll see you back on the road next week.